Hey guys, it's Fida and today I've come up with a really special video. Many of you had asked me to put more vlogs as you liked my earlier ones. So that's what I have today. It's a weekend vlog and I'm also going to show you a small glimpse of my room. As so many people had asked me to put my house tour. And this is just my room. I'll show you the full house later in some other video. So this is my room and this is the study table and I have quite a few drawers right here in which I keep earphones, then some spectacles and Uno you know, cards and stuff like that. And then I have another second drawer in which I keep all of my school stationery and supplies. I also keep a mic which I use for filming right here. That's the mic. Some wrapping paper and stuff. And then this final drawer is my favorite in which I keep all of my baking supplies. So here I have all of my baking supplies. And right here I have my baking tip set. Many of them ha had asked which baking tips I use and I use the Wilton 55 tip set. If you're planning to buy baking tips, this is the best to buy because it has all the necessary tips and it's really simple to use. So I'm going to keep that back right there. Then I have a few spatulas, um, my offset spatulas and stuff, some dowels, some cupcake liners, all my food coloring, some measuring cups, wax candles. My, I also have my thermometer, candy thermometer and some cookie cutters. That's it in that drawer. I also have a dustbin right there. And then that's a file and some other books. That's my madrasa bag which I go. And coming here, I have my cream that I use and a little flower pot with my Quran. And then right here I have my prayer mat. It's on my chair. Then coming to the right side, I have some hollow drawers in which I just keep my chessboard, dominoes, some books which I like. So I love Geronimo Stilton books. These are like really amazing books. And then I also have some knowledge based books like tell me where, tell me how, tell me when and stuff. I also have a big dictionary right behind. Then some other stuff. I also have this kinetic sand which I play with all the time. And then coming down I keep all of my books and I also have my AC remote. And coming again down, this is where I keep my bag. That Winterfest is a prize I won from a baking contest. And then again below I have some other baking necessaries like my baking pans. And then inside I have some square pans. This is, these are round pans. 2 inch, 4 inch, 6 inch and stuff. And then here I keep my abaya which I normally use to school. Some other abayas which I use for special occasions are inside the drawers. And then I also hang my prayer dress right there. Next coming is my shelf in which I keep all of my dresses. So these are my dresses. Right here I have some shawls. Then my overcoats and then some traditional dresses, some skirts and then pants. I also have some big frocks, long tops and then some casual dresses right there. And down below here I have my bags which I use outside most of the time. And then there's another drawer up where I keep all of my night dresses and there's another shelf down also where I keep some other stuff like socks and stuff like school uniforms and right here I have a mirror in which I keep all of the accessories 
bangles, earrings and some cream and this is homemade kajal which my grandmother makes at home we come with it all the time when we come from India it's really good for your eyes if you have itching problem and then here I have my hula loop which I play with all the time and then that's it for my room up there I have my bed so I climb these stairs right here to get above my bed and my study table is below my bed so let me show you so this is my bed and right side I have some prayer which I have to say when I wake up in the morning my father just stuck it over there so that I don't forget it and then getting up I have two pillows right there because I'm always scared at night to sleep alone so I have gone to that pillow I'm scared no more then looking through here is my brother's room where my big brother and small brother study and sleep so this is my brother's room and this big shelf in which i just climbed on is the division between our rooms so they have their bed right there with both of their study tables and it's like a drawer bed so we can push it and pull it whenever we want i'll just show you how it looks in detail so here they have a dustbin this is the bed some prayer mats there then my camera stand which I use for filming both of the laptops my brother's study tables and this is the bed you can just pull it out whenever you want like a draw and then you can push it in also and that's it in their room So this is the shelf I talked about. This is the big division between our rooms. And up there is my room and my bed. So now let's get on to my morning routine. It's currently 4 o'clock in the morning. My mother comes and puts the light. Then from here... That's my big brother and small brother who are sleeping. My mother goes and on the light. And after a long time, my small brother wakes up. He really doesn't do his bed. He just pushes all his stuff onto my big brother. And then he has done his bed. He offs the AC and tries to call my brother, though he doesn't wake up that early. Then after a long time, he wakes up. As soon as I wake up, I go brush my teeth and then I do my morning prayer. After that, we all go and drink a full glass of water with three dates. This is something that's really good to prevent all diseases. Just eat it right away in the morning before eating anything else. And this is something that my father has strictly told us to do. And then after that, I go make the tiffins. Most of the time, my mother is the one who's making tiffins, but then today, just because it's burgers, when it's like burgers, sandwiches and stuff, and I make it on my own, I make it for all three of us and then pack the tiffins. Today, I'm, I'm having some kiwi with some nuts and burger.
I actually have a recipe on burgers in which I'm showing how to make the patties and how to assemble the burgers. So if you want to check it out, I'll leave a link in the description down below. And there my tiffin is packed. I close the lid and take it. And after that we get ready with our uniforms and we eat breakfast. Today morning we had put and uh, green gram curry. We don't like it much so then our father just feeds us in case we skip it. And then we are ready to go. Actually my brother's bus comes a bit earlier. So they get out first. They wait for their bus and there their buses come, they go and then after some time even I leave. So it's time for me to leave. I put on my abaya shoes and then I'm ready to go. My grandmother was there at that time. So. And then I have two of my neighbors coming with me. So we go out together. And my bus has come. Then we leave too. And then that's it in the morning. After that we're at school and we come in the evening, maybe around 2.30. My brother's bus comes early and drop them. And I come a little bit late. After coming home, we have a bath and then we eat our food. As it was a weekend, we plan to go out or normally we're at home studying and then by eight o'clock we sleep. We don't stay out a lot late, we just sleep by 8 o'clock itself. My father has strictly told to sleep by 8 o'clock, so... It was a weekend and then we went out. We had a lot of fun and we also got wet in the boat ride. So that's exactly it for this video. After that we went home. We had food from outside so then we didn't wait to eat from home and then we just went and slept. That's it for the video. Hope you liked it. Please subscribe to my channel. Also like, share, comment. Thanks for watching. Love cooking. Bye.